Hello everyone, welcome back to another Code in Chat with Zach. Today we're going to make a quick bat file, a .bat file, that will allow us to open our browser of choice and any websites that we would like to open with it. Now why is this beneficial? Well, let's say that you have a particular hobby and with that hobby you have several websites that you open each time. You can create a simple batch file that will allow you to open all of those pages at once. You could create another icon or a bat file that will be for work, maybe one for the husband or the wife, so it allows you power over your computer. So let's go ahead and get started. If you remember last week we went ahead and created the start CMD and so let's go ahead and click that and open our command prompt here. The next thing we want to do is find out where our browser is. Uh, today we're going to be talking about using Firefox so we'll go to the C drive program files x86 We'll look for Mozilla right here. And notice that the Firefox application is here. So let's go ahead and create our bat file. And so we'll do that by typing in notepad and then the name. And we're going to call this Firefox underscore all since it will be mini. However, you can name it whatever you like. And don't forget the dot bat. When we hit enter, it will say this is not found. Do you want to create it? Yes, we do. So the first thing that we do is we type at echo off. Now we want to change the directory. Remember, it will follow the command line down in essence. So we want to right click up here and then right click and copy. Notice this tells us where the Mozilla Firefox application resides. And we do that by typing CD or change directory and then we can paste that. We'll go down to the next line and we will start firefox.exe. Let's go ahead and save that. Close that real quick. And notice that we have our Firefox BAT icon, the gears. So let's go ahead and click on that. And voila, we have our Firefox. But we want it to open particular uh, websites for us. That's the point of creating this particular bat file. So we'll go ahead and open once again our, fire, our Firefox file in Notepad. And we can do that by simply typing www.youtube.com. We'll save that once again and close this and go ahead and run. Notice that YouTube has now been opened. Let's say you would like to do multiple files. So let's go ahead and add another one. Let's say www google.com and you do that by adding a space save that and YouTube and then Google well I hope this helps thank you for stopping by happy coding and have a good day